Hi. Long time no see. Um, I haven't made a video in a while, but I've been meaning to. I've been wanting to. I've been telling myself for months now. Other people have been telling me, fuck. So I was thinking, hey, Tharan, you should make a YouTube video. Cause you're not doing anything else. And all you do is watch YouTube videos. Why don't you make a YouTube video? But then I'm like, I tried making YouTube videos, but I get too, I don't know what to make. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to say, blah, 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 blue, making excuses. So here's what I came up with today. I'm just gonna write like a list of things to do and I'm just gonna do them while recording. This accomplishes two things. I have footage for a video I can try and I do things because I never do anything. Okay, let's just write these things down. <laughs> to do. Underline. One eternity later. Hi, um, I'm just editing this video and I realized a bunch of this footage is really long and boring, so I'm just gonna cut it out. Here's the list of things that I came up with that I actually ended up doing. Because I wrote a lot of things, but I didn't do most of them. But these are the four things I did, so yeah. Okay, I'm gonna start with um, the scavenging stuff. I just gotta break apart a few things and take out the components I want. So let's start. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking, like, I feel like everyone should think about it, or has at least at some point, it's like, you realize, okay, I'm gonna die someday, so what do I do about it? Like, we're probably not gonna live forever biologically. Like, most likely we're gonna end up giving up our, uh, blood sacs. There we go. <laughs> My dad said to throw this stuff out, and I'm like, I was like, just give me till Tuesday to take the stuff I want, and then I'll throw it out. And he was like, fine, deal, but you got till Tuesday. And it's Monday, so you gotta do this today. Why are you giving up though? You always give up on things. This is your problem, darling. Don't give up! Unless there's no point. Because then you might as well give up. Because what's the point of anything? Let's <laughs> wrap on this segment. I took the first can apart. Turns out it doesn't work. Note to self test it before you spend time breaking it apart to get the part you want. Because you might just be wasting your time. And um, I'm just gonna give up on the second fan because I'm done. I'll explain the snail eggs now. I don't think you can see that because it's backwards, but um, snail eggs, what did I want to do? So I have like, I've been into, I don't know, I've had an aquarium for a while and I've been like getting more and more interested into like plants and like aquatic biology. One of the things that ended up happening was I ended up somehow getting a lot of pond snails. I didn't buy these snails, they just sort of showed up somehow. And they lay these eggs, like they multiply, first of all, they multiply way too fast. I'm trying to figure out how to like ethically get rid of them. So like I bought one of their predators an assassin snail off Kijiji for like five bucks, but they're not killing them fast enough. But that's not the point of this video. The point of this video was like, I always, I always saw these like things in the aquarium and I didn't know what, the, what it was. And then I realized these are snail eggs. And then I was like, wait a minute, I've got a microscope that I never use. Why don't I see what these snail eggs look like under a microscope? And I've told myself I'll do it eventually for like three months now. But now, since you're asking so nicely, I'll do it for you. Boop. 
you couldn't see what I just did there, but I, like I'm looking at a screen of myself and I just booped my own nose, like like that. But I did it on the screen, but you couldn't tell because I didn't boop the camera, I booped like. Okay, let's just start. something I wanted to do and now I've done it next thing to do today is okay let's talk melon melon seeds what is that about let me explain so a couple days ago I came across this research paper I'll um, link it below but basically it got me really excited about melons so melons like uh, cantaloupe uh, watermelon cucumber uh, pumpkin, squash, like, most squashes, um, they're all part of the same family called the cucurbitaceae. It's like the gourd family, so it's like all those, all those veg fruits, fruits that I mentioned. And what's special, like what the research paper was talking about is, like I, I had been, uh, I've been looking at what grafting is and like, and like plant stuff. Recently grafting is basically like when you get like cut off the stem of like, like you cut off part of a plant and you transplant it onto another plant that has a root system already built in and then like, like it fuses together and it works. And so like the paper was talking about hybridization and how like, it, it's like, I honestly, I didn't even read the whole thing. I just read like the abstract, but like I'll read it eventually. I bookmarked it. Um, anyway, I wanted to do an experiment with, um, like I wanted to grow melon seeds and I also wanted to like experiment with like the best way of, okay, so there's gonna be four groups. There's gonna be, there's like these like pots of soil. There's two of these. And then there's this like the Ziploc and paper method for like germinating the seeds. So there's gonna be six, six, 12 seeds, three in the pot, three in pot one, three in pot two, three in bag one, three in bag two. The bags and the pots are like different to like see if it's, to see if it germinates better in a bag or in, or in soil with the pot. And the second difference is gonna be the water I use. For the pots, they're just gonna be by this window. So I'm gonna get on that really, really soon. See ya.